reduce, decided to, to take the odds. And we've been told that he's, he's less of an impact when they land on your opponent. Now, Torre Campo is a slugger, stopping the previously unbeaten Reynante Rojo and Marvin Corpus. Here we Torre go, Campo Torre Campo. Walking to the body. Torre Campo in blue at all phased by the, by the reputation of the unbeaten fighter. He's a big puncher. And, and one thing, of course, if uh, Manny Pacquiao, Pacquiao with a good assault. good flurry of punches that time. But as I said, the heavier glove comes to punching. He goes up to Torre Campo. Beautiful right up up by Pacquiao. And the crowd on his angered. And he thinks that, you know, he's left. Oh, beautiful left by Pacquiao. Flash on the face of... I mean, this is a slugfest. Torre oh, beautiful. Torre... And stripes down the side against the hard-hitting Rustico Torre Campo in blue. And the first sound, oh, he missed with the left uppercut. Pacquiao going with the one-two. Even more dangerous is the fact that he likes to fight south. Oh. Watch the combination again by Pacquiao. You know, this is for that time, Kinito. Yes. But Torre Campo is fighting back. It's nailed by Pacquiao. And look at that. Notice the intelligence of Manny Pacquiao. Oh, good combination against Pacquiao. Oh, not a cracking combination. And Pacquiao walking to the body and cracking him to the head. Oh. Torre Campo, as Ronnie Nathaniel said, upcoming is the Philippine Junior Bantamweight title. Torre Campo has carried the fight to Pacquiao. Oh! Pacquiao! He's out! He's out. It's, it's over. He cannot get up on that. It's time. over. It's over. Manny Pacquiao, one punch, and his eyes are crossed. His eyes are crossed, Torre Campo. He's going to walk into that left. Just one punch. One punch.